All right, we're going to go through it pretty quick. We're going to look at how to do a mass update for organizations. Go to search organizations, maybe somewhere else on your menu, depending on what you have customized. That's communicate.cfm is the page name. From this page, of course, we can search a multitude of things. Um, I'm just going to do a search for company. And then once you get your list here, you can select all uh, or you can just pick from the list what you want to update and then go down to the bottom, click the mass update button. That'll take you over to the update page and from here you'll have a list of update templates that have been built. If there aren't any here or if you want to update something else, tell it you want to create a new template. Give the template a name. and then put your cursor in the body area here and click the add values button from here it'll give you a list of organization fields and contact fields if you're updating one of your custom fields up here under choose form you'll have a list of your custom forms here And if you pick one of those it'll filter down to what those user defined fields are uh, answer one and answer two is what will allow you to change so we can pick the, the uh, UDFs here, click select and then it'll put them into the body here for you. Once you have the fields in the body that you want to update, click save. It'll close uh, that window or that tab and it'll reload the update page for you there. Still have our, inf our organizations that we selected. Pick the template that you just created. Hit continue and up pops a screen with all of the fields that you had selected. Uh, this happens to be a text field, so I can update the uh, text field. If it's a drop-down, it'll, it'll have a list of options there. It says at the bottom, are you sure you want to update all of the records? And you say yes. And it'll run through this page. Obviously, if you're updating many records, it'll run through these 50 at a time and um, process them until it's done. And then once it's done, it'll close the window, and that's it. If you go back in and look at any of these now, they'll be updated with your new info.